Hi and welcome to Text Nation TV. My name's Rusty G. I'm Alan. And uh, it looks like we're away from home. Yeah. I, I think we're at a Best Buy and we're and out the, here freezing. We're, yeah, we're not smoking. That That's breathing. That, that's going on right now. That's right. We're out here for a special edition of Black Ops release. We're here for the play it before you can buy it. That's yeah, the right. play it early event happening here at our local Best Buy was gracious enough to let us stand out and freeze in front of their store. So <laughs> to that, we say thank you. No, uh, the staff's been very cooperative. Uh, Rusty has been inside filming in the heat. <laughs> I've been guarding the uh, Text Nation TV mobile, as you can see here. <laughs> So I love it. We, Alan even took the time to come out here with a light, and he is he's out here. Hey, we, we don't kid around. This, uh, this, this is real. <laughs> exactly. It's real cold. That's what it is. We're going to be here for at least the next couple of hours trying to catch everybody playing the game. I hear there's a 3D version inside that these guys can play. Oh, really? There's 3D glasses that they're handing out that I saw when they came in. Looks I know all, some of these TVs they're playing on is fantastic. This is ridiculous. Makes my they're plasma playing, look like garbage. They're, look, they're playing inside the Magnolia home theater systems. I will show you more of that later. We've got clips of these guys playing. Yeah. Let's get started, and this is Black Ops Release Party. Best Buy. Hey, we're at the uh, Call of Duty play it, play it Early event here at Best Buy, and we got some gamers here. I don't want to get in their way because, you know, I mean, they're picking out rocket launchers and something called a death machine, so I don't want to get in their way too bad, but how do you like it so far? Talk loud. Dude, it's freaking awesome. Like, you just run around and kill people, and it's cool because the, snipe, the sniping's cool. It's not like Black Ops. That's good. Yeah, yeah but it, it's, it's cool so far. I'm, I'm looking forward to having it. All right, cool. So is there something that you wish was on here that you thought was going to be on here, or is everything that you've seen so far is totally what you wanted? Pretty much everything that I've seen so far is everything that I wanted. I haven't been able to see all the maps. I I'm hoping that they have a 1v1 map, but besides that, like, everything seems cool. All right, cool. Appreciate it. What's your name? My Morgan. Morgan? Alan, man. Appreciate it. Thanks. Thank all right. It's uh, Morgan approved. We got another set of gamers here at Best Buy. They've got tons of TV set up, gorgeous LG TV set up. Um, the bezel's so thin that it makes my plasma look like garbage. But I'm gonna try to figure out here some feedback from the game. Hey, how's it going, man? Pretty good, man. You? Doing well. So, is there something to, about the game that you wish was on there that's not on there, or is everything so far what you've wanted to see? Everything so far is pretty good. The, the sniping to me is not as good as in the last games probably, but everything else is pretty good. The explosions are pretty crazy too. All right, cool. Uh, yeah, I've heard the same thing about the sniping, but uh, maybe later on they'll develop a, an add-on or something to, to fix that. All right, cool, man. What's your name? My name is Joey. 
All right, Joey Malaman, appreciate it. Thanks, man. Keep playing. All right, so we're continuing our Black Ops coverage here uh, with Text Nation TV. Uh, again, this is being projected from behind us onto a friggin' awesome screen. And have I first got to ask, let's introduce yourself. Hi, what's your name? My name is Trey. All right, Trey, have you played the game yet? Or you just um, played. It's great. Like the graphics and the gameplay. Okay, so you. I'm going to say, just based upon you being here, you probably own Black Ops 1, Modern, Modern Warfare 3, all the previous ones, this. In comparison to those, how do you think about this one? Uh, I think it's the best. It's not better than Modern Warfare 2, but it's better than Modern, War, Modern Warfare 3 and Black Ops. Yeah. Okay, so let me ask you this. There's a new feature that they're starting out with Black, uh, Black Ops 2 here. They're doing YouTube live streaming, being able to stream your games straight direct to YouTube. Have you heard of this? Not yet. <laughs> okay, so yeah, something new. YouTube live streaming. You can actually take this game and stream straight live to the YouTube or to the YouTube to YouTube, so that you can share it with your friends. Hey, watch me kill this guy with a freaking knife from 80 yards out. Freaking knife. How do you think it's gonna be? Yes, I'm. A, yes, I, I'm gonna love it. Yeah. So I have to ask. You obviously play either PlayStation, Xbox, something like that. What's your What's your box of choice? Xbox 360. What's your gamer tag? Monty Carter. Monty Carter. Now, how do you spell that so we can have people look you up, and then they're gonna start fragging you on uh, Black Ops 2? N E Y C A R T E R. Now, when we have people start fragging you from the game, it came from us. So we're just gonna go ahead and let you know now. So. But we're going to let you get back to the game, enjoy the rest of your night, because we're going to be here for a few hours. And uh, you're going to be here to buy the game at midnight and walk out? Yes. Awesome. More interviews coming up. All right, so we're continuing our coverage here at Best Buy here in West Nashville, and uh, I'm standing here watching more, more gameplay uh, before it gets released to the public. Uh, but as of this viewing, obviously you've probably got it. You own it. You're downloading it, and I, and I want to kind of throw this guy off in the middle of his gaming. I want to see if he can multitask while he's playing uh, and see see what his thoughts are on the game. So uh, you've been playing for at least. Uh, six minutes or so, I would say. Uh, what do you think of the game so far? It's pretty good so far. It's pretty, pretty sweet. Now, when you say the old Black Ops, we're talking about the original Black Ops before this, obviously, because there's been Modern Warfare versions, things like that. This is Treyarch Studios and stuff like that. What do you think about Treyarch? Pretty good so far. Uh, great studios, make some great games, so it's pretty good so far. If I were to tell you that they are about to allow YouTube live streaming from your video games... Straight from your Xbox, what would you what would you tell me? Uh, that'd be pretty sweet. See how the bad kids play and let us pwn some noobs for them. Now you just said pwn some noobs. That tells me that you you've been playing this for like at least a couple minutes. I would say. Do you consider yourself a pro? Definitely not a pro, but been playing for eight years now. Eight years. You've been playing eight years. What what kind of games have you been playing for eight years? Started back in Halo two days. That's off and on before then, but Halo 2 Day is my big day. So. Did, you ever, did you ever play the original Halo? I did, I did. It was very sweet. Uh, of course, Xbox Live was not a big thing then, but Halo was pretty sweet. So. Yeah, Halo was the game that got me started on Xbox uh, before it went 360. You know, I, I still have my original Microsoft Xbox sitting in a box somewhere collecting dust, and I'm sure at some point in time, I hope in the near future, I can sell it to a museum for like $500. Well, I'm still in the original box. You still have yours in the original box? Original box. Do you still have all the original controllers wired or wireless? I, I got a few controllers. I'm not sure about all the original ones, but they're somewhere in the house. So you have a collection somewhere of old Xbox games. Did you, did you ever mod your original Xbox? Because I know there's a lot of gamers out there that modded for purposes unbeknownst to me, but for the rest of us that know that we uh, 
copied <coughs> games and uh, maybe put them on hard drives. I don't know. What about you? We'll just leave that one unsaid. <laughs> I like the way that you just kind of sidestepped that. Uh, so, obviously, uh, this is a big release party. We're here at Best Buy here in West Nashville. Uh, they're allowing us to play on their Magnolia home studio systems that they've got here. What do you think about the surround sound and everything that you're playing on? Uh, it's not bad. Mediocre a little bit on the speakers, but not bad. Mediocre? That makes me think that you're a home theater guy, and you've got something a lot better than what they've got. So tell us about that. Uh, nothing particular right now, but I do IT work for a living. I deal with audio and computers for a living, so that's what I do on a daily basis. So. so there you have it. A gamer at heart, but an audio technician at a pro. He says IT, but I think he's lying. But that's fine. We'll let him get back to the game. More interviews coming up. Hi, I'm Alan with Text Nation TV, and like we said before, we're here at the Play It Early event live at Best Buy here at West Nashville, Tennessee. It's going down. I've got Matt here, sales supervisor, which says here on his, on his tag. How you doing? <laughs> hey, Matt, is it what you expect it to be? Um, less, more? I mean, we're definitely excited about it. Um, we, we've definitely had the excitement of all of these customers in here. Um, it's about what we expect every time, you know. Uh, get some passion in here and get some good gaming going on. All right, yeah, we've seen a lot of people lining up, especially for the midnight release of Call of Duty Black Ops 2, which I've got mine early, <laughs> as you can see. Now, uh, it's going to be available on the Xbox, uh, PlayStation. Is there a Wii version? Uh, <laughs> there will be. It's a Wii U version. Really? Yeah. Well, you heard it here first. It's going to be on the Wii, so you uh, bowlers out there, get ready. We're coming for you. All right, um... So how long are you gonna looking to be here tonight? Uh, we we usually close up shop around 12:30 to 1 a.m. Um, just depending on how the traffic flows. Um, you know, if we have anybody coming around here at 12:30 from other stores, so got gotcha. stay open a good bit. So other stores will send customers over here as well. So you're telling mm -hmm. us that you've got plenty in stock, ready for the holidays. You don't have to come here and fight old ladies on Black Friday. Oh, come no. here tomorrow. Come here right now. Get your copy of Black Ops 2. All right, so I, I had to Alan off the of camera because in true real life, I'm the gamer. I've had an Xbox since Xbox was ever made or ever thought of. I mean, there's rumors of 720 coming around. We don't know what's going to happen. Oh, yeah. So uh, let me ask you this. Yeah. Xbox or PlayStation? Uh, I'm definitely going with the Xbox. Being a core gamer, um, you're looking at they're going to Exclusives. Uh, there's even a rumored deal of Call of Duty going to the uh, Microsoft world. Oh, wow. And Xbox. So yeah. what do you think about, since Treyarch Studios has taken over uh, the Call of Duty and that whole thing, uh, what do you think about them taking over and making it their own world, basically? Uh, you, you know what? I'm excited for it. Uh, I'm, al I'm always in to see a new developer, a new look on things. Um, fan of Infinity Ward as well. Right. So. I'm I'm looking forward to it. Okay, so Halo Four. I kind of got to talk about this because this is also the number two game that's gonna be. It's gonna be Black Ops Two or it's gonna be Halo Four. Halo Four oh, just yeah. last week. Tonight it's Black Ops Two. What do you think is gonna be the number one game for the end of the year? Oh man, that's a good one. That's a good one. I I think Call of Duty may win out just because it's multi-platform. Right. It's got that going for it. But call um Halo. Halo blew my mind. So Not you've been lie. playing it all week long. Oh, I have been. So have how been. many hours have you logged in already? <laughs> <laughs> That's a bad question. He's like, I took off a few days of work. <laughs> I took a personal day. I think I took in a sick day, something like That's, that. That's right. Hey, they had me MIA for a while there. <laughs> well, let me, let me ask you this. Uh, gamer tag for Xbox 360. Mm -hmm. What's your gamer tag? Uh, it, it's a strange one. It's uh, Mac Daddy 2290. Okay, 2290. I do. As we want everybody that is listening and watching this podcast, Mac Daddy 22, look him up, and we're gonna frag him for the rest of the week. So make sure he either goes home and goes back to work, or at least <laughs> takes a shower. I don't, but we'll see what happens. Uh, I, I have to ask though, because obviously none of us at home or any of our viewers, I don't think, have this set up. You've got a set up here in the Magnolia Home Theater Center behind us we've got 5.1 7.1 i'm sure there's a 9.1 in there somewhere oh yeah you know 
Uh, we definitely appreciate you letting us come in and do this whole thing. Uh, how Alan? Alan, I think we talked. Said he's going to be here till one a.m. or so. You know, okay. getting everybody in out. Mm -hmm. And I and I throw a punch at your neighbors across the street because mm -hmm. there's a <clears throat> GameStop across the street <laughs> that's got some people, but they don't have oh, yeah. pizza. Nope. They don't have the Magnolia Home Theater nope. system. We've even got a pro gamer here among us, from what I understand. This oh, yeah. is one of your uh, two of them. Yeah, two, of, two them. of them. Okay, so we've got pro gamers here. Are you a pro gamer? I'm not. I'm not. Are I, you, is that a life a thing that you want to that you want to do at some point in time? Uh, no, not currently, but <laughs> I'm definitely a, a gamer for life. That's okay. For sure. All right. We're going to let you get back to working, if if you can call this working, because, I mean, there's Barker loungers, there's 3D TVs. That's right, man. There's all sorts of things going we got on. got decked out, heating and everything. I love it, and we're not having to freeze. So thank you very much for hanging out uh -huh. with us. Appreciate you coming in, man. All right, so we're here now with uh, Texas Nation TV's own uh, Rusty Greer. So, uh, Rusty, what do you think? Uh, so far, uh, the bots are pretty easy. I mean, I've uh, included four bots on this level just to see if I can kind of get around. Oh, come on. How in the world am I? Seriously? I had the high ground. Rusty's dead. I had the freaking high ground. And those glasses don't make you look ridiculous at all. So, uh, I mean, I'm wearing 3D glasses, playing on a 3D TV. I'm retarded. And Rusty's dead again. Stay tuned for more of uh, Rusty pretty much dying. All right, we're 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 getting back into uh, finding out what's actually going on here. Yeah, and we're about uh, I think almost an hour away till midnight. Yep. So the crowd should start coming in more and more and more. And we've had a few. Come in, and LG has handed us a set of 3D glasses, which are fantastic. Because, by the way, if you haven't seen it, you can't really see it on the film. But behind us, there's an LG TV, which I, as you see here, it's much like the one that you see here. Pretty uh, much no bezel. It's yeah, just gorgeous. It's a beautiful TV. Rusty I to, died at least five times on uh, it, and it looks let's, fantastic. Let's not tell him about that. But I mean, I had a really good time. I was playing, you know. The Black Ops 2 in 3D, it's really immersive, and that's the cool thing about it is it's not your parents' 3D. Yeah. It's it's not the red and blue anymore. You're not wearing plastic, or I mean paper. Uh, yeah, the red and blue lens, uh, lenses. This yeah. ain't coming out, of, coming, out of a yeah. coming out of a Captain Crunch box anymore. <laughs> so, I mean, we've got glasses on, and seriously. LG if, wouldn't put their name on it if it wasn't quality. Exactly. And LG puts everything great. I mean, LG. Life their we have their TVs on our walls. Exactly. We trust them. Exactly. And so he's put on, you know, they're inside of this Magnolia home theater thing. There's all sorts of TVs. It's awesome. What I want to talk about was some of the things that are being given away here tonight. We're actually probably just a few minutes away. If you're wearing, I keep doing this the wrong way. If you're wearing the wristband, you can't really see this. Uh, but if you're wearing the wristband, you actually get some chance to win things like one of these right here. Uh, as Alan holds this up, you can't really see that there, but what it is, you're getting a one month, well, let me take that back, it's the 160 point Xbox yeah, 160 Live points. tokens that you get to actually use for purchase on Xbox Live. So if you're here and you don't have one in your hand and you're seeing this now, you might want to call Best Buy back and find out why you didn't get one because everybody here should have one. Yeah. Also, they're giving away uh, a one month Xbox uh, subscription, so make sure you, if, again, if you missed out on this, call back to the store and find out why you didn't get one in hand. And it looks like somebody's, I think I saw a t-shirt given away. Yeah, I there think, were uh, the first uh, couple of people. Yeah, there were, there's t-shirts being given away. There's we didn't be, get one. There's going to be a uh, Xbox 360 controller given away. There's going to be a PS3 controller given away. The game. And the They're giving away the game. Giving away. There's going to be a hard copy of that. There's going to be a set of turtles. Beach headphones, and if you know anything about Turtle Beach, yeah, those are amazing headphones. I don't know the retail value on that. Don't quote me on that. I can't tell you how much it is, but I know that uh, you will get a chance of that. And I think everybody here got some gamer grub. Is that right, guys? Everybody get gamer grub. Gamer that, grub. That what that How's was? It taste? Was it good? Was it bad? It was great. Oh, we got this. We, oh, look, this this is the t-shirt. We got a fantastic. Thing. Here's yeah, our LG t-shirt. Yeah. Well, there we go. Look at this. Our LG guy is so nice. So here's here's what we're gonna do. 
for those of you that weren't here and you're seeing this now on our website or on youtube.com slash destination TV, what I want you to do is go down below, comment, just leave a comment, like the video, yeah. subscribe. Those are the three things you got to do. You got to subscribe, you got to like this video, and then leave a comment below, and we will give away this free first one. First, first, well, maybe not the first one. That's kind of cheating, but you know, I'll, I'll randomly select whoever gets this. We'll give this shirt away on this episode, so make sure you comment below for that. So not only are we giving away things here tonight, we will give something away to you later. So make sure you check out the website, techstation.tv, youtube.com slash techstation. Facebook.com slash TextNationTV, Twitter.com slash TV. Basically, if it's online and you can subscribe to it and you You'll can follow it, it's slash TV. So make sure you hang out there. And, uh, leave a comment below, yeah. and uh, we're going to continue watching all these gamers uh, get into it. So Yeah, and Rusty get killed some more. All right, as we're wrapping up here, everybody is uh, purchasing their copy of Call of Duty Black Ops. Purchasing. They better be had already prepaid, and they better be in that line over there. Because when I just walked over there, there was nobody in the purchasing line. If oh. you want to buy it right now, you can go get it. I'm just saying. But anyway, go ahead. Well, Sorry. that's what I meant. The, the transaction is taking place. <laughs> right, right, right. You want to you get technical about it. <laughs> so a big shout-out to Best Buy. Thank you for letting us come out and take over for a little bit. Store number right here because I don't remember it, so you'll be seeing it on the lower third right there. <laughs> I don't remember the store number, but it's right there. Yeah, thank you, it's store here. number. It's here in the Nashville West Shopping Center. Also, thanks uh, for them for letting us stand out there and freeze for a minute, too. We appreciate that very much. Absolutely. I can get the feeling back in my fingers right now. <laughs> but a big shout-out to the staff. They were all supportive. Um, Rusty, did you have a good time? I had a blast. I got to, I got to sit down and lose. Uh, I, I will admit, I did lose. Yeah, you're pretty uh, terrible at it. I, you know, it's sad. I've, I've had every Call of Duty since the first Call of Duty, and you would think at this point I would be a pro at it. I'm not. Well, you're 30. Exactly. That's what it is. I've got 12-year-old kids that can come in on Xbox Live and kill me. So, I mean, <laughs> uh, it's neither here nor there. But, yeah, we had a good time. We got to play with, you know, 3D, as it were. Likewise, like I said before, it's not your mom and dad's 3D. Yeah, fantastic uh, products from LG. Awesome TVs. Uh, we were in the Magnolia Home Theater Center. That was awesome. We had 5.1, 6.1, 7.1, and I'm sure there was an 8.1 somewhere in there. It was really cool. There was one on a projector. Yeah, we the projector was awesome. We talked to a lot of guys. Yeah, uh, a lot of gamers. You, yeah, a lot of gamers. You aren't such a big gamer, but give us, give us what you think about the game, being the fact you're not a big gamer. Well, the graphics look fantastic. I'm sure um, LG helps with that as well with well, the, the, TV, with the, with the, with the TVs yeah, yeah. they have. But <laughs> the graphics in the game, uh, they look good. Um, the players seem to be into it, and that's what's important for yeah. the for the game developers and the store, you know? Exactly. That the gamers are into it. Yeah. And also the the backstories that come with these games, you know, with, um, is it it's Medal of Honor, I think, that has the uh, the Navy SEALs. Uh, uh, we, we won't talk about that because those guys are losing their jobs, but that's fine. <laughs> well, you know, just the, the backstories that come along with it is that they got to uh, research. They want to make these games so so lifelike that yeah. they're willing to and I, and I think that's what reach out, is trying to do. Yeah, yeah reach yeah. out to the armed forces and, you know, try yeah. to, hey, let's get it as close as we can. Maybe not put every missile code on the game, <laughs> but let's get it as close as we can so that uh, the gamer will come and just have a fulfilled experience. Yeah. So... I like it. Uh, like I said, not a big gamer, but yeah, I'll definitely be buying my copy within the next couple of days. Maybe not right now. Oh, I might. I might. Uh, we'll see what happens. We'll see if we can't work something. Yeah, you out, need some practice. I. It, I mean, I know that. Yeah. So anyway, guys, thanks again for watching this full entire episode, all the interviews and everything we did. Thank you for everyone that showed up and was on video, talked with us, sat with us, played, you know, games, whatever it is. Yeah, it, it, it was a great time, even though it's like midnight one, whatever. Yeah, you know, whatever time. Everybody's it is. still up, full of energy, having a having a good time. I'm sure I probably won't go to bed. So uh, again, we have the T-shirt to give away, the free T-shirt that we got. Leave a comment below, like this video, and subscribe to our channel. Tell your friends. Go subscribe. We'll give away a free shirt. I, well, I'll figure out the semantics on that later. But anyway, yeah. uh, don't forget our website. All the things that we do is textnation.tv. That's T-X-T-Nation. 
TV. Where else can you find us? You can check out all of our videos at our YouTube channel, youtube.com slash TV. And if you want to friend us on Facebook, you can just hit that like button right there, facebook.com slash TV. And all the tech news that you can use is our Twitter feed, twitter.com slash TV. And everything spills on over into our Google+. Plus. Check it out, gplus.to slash TV. Well, guys, that's our time, and we're getting ready to sign off. We'll see you next episode. Thanks, guys.